Rosie Gilang Priscilla Chera, Pangulo ng Pakyas Association of Rural Improvement Club. Ang aming agri-products na pinuproduce, unang-una ay ang kalamansi concentrate with honey. Yung challenges, kinakailangan namin ng LTO license to operate dahil maraming kumukuha sa amin ng aming mga produkto na dinadala nila sa ibang bansa. Hindi yung pangalan ng parik ang nagagamit, hindi kami nakikilala, pero kami ang nagmamanufacture dito sa Oriental Mindoro. Uh, the Korean government through its development cooperation agency, Koika, is carrying out a project for rural communities in Oriental Mindoro to help promote climate resilient and inclusive green growth. We partnered with the Global Green Growth Institute in trying to engage players in the agriculture value chain, including more than 9,000 farm workers through green modernization of their cooperative facilities or the establishment of a new provincial agriculture center. GGGI, first and foremost, provides for the province the strengthening of the green growth planning. It's a very important thing. And this project collaboration between GGGI and the province of Oriental Mindoro will surely redound to the benefit of the farmers. Our farmers, which are actually the biggest drivers of the local economy, must be part of this overall action that we take towards better production. The COICA's ongoing project with GGGI is much needed and has a strong potential. Oriental Mindoro was an appropriate area to implement the project, considering its climate vulnerability and heavy dependence on agriculture. The DTI's role in the agricultural project in uh, Oriental Mindoro is to support the MSMEs uh, in the climate resilient uh, processing of their produce. Malaki ang maitutulong na sa amin ng GGGI Koika dito sa project na ito kasi bibigyan nila kami ng isang building na FDA compliant at mga modernong pasilidad, equipments, na ito ang mag-aangat sa amin para mapalaki yung production ng aming pinuproduce na kalamansi concentrate. The Global Green Growth Institute is the main implementing entity of this project. We feel a great responsibility to make this project successful. Our approach is targeted to strengthen the business model of smallholder farmers and their cooperatives, who are often not compensated properly in the current value chain. Napakalaking tulong ang idudulot nito sa ating mga magsasaka at sa, siyempre, may mga effect ito sa ating ekonomiya. And uh, with this also, sa project na ito, makapag-produce tayo ng kumbaga, uh, world-class quality product. Kasi nga, modern tools and equipment na, modern, modern processing facility. This way, we can address untapped potentials of smallholder farmers as agri-entrepreneurs and improve the lives of their community in a more climate resilient and economically sustainable way. Now, though we are in the midst of pandemic, GGG has still managed to fully work and contribute to this undertaking. And the provincial government, despite the pandemic also, I would like to sincerely express our heart of gratitude to this initiative that you are extending to our province and to our people. As the urgency to address climate change is ever increasing, we hope that this project could work as a good model in our joint efforts to build climate resilient and economically vibrant rural communities throughout the Philippines. Thank you.